Some of the indicators of overreaching and overtraining that have scientific support really are out there. Some of the first ones that we see are actually psychological. You get disruptions in mood, depression, anxiety. When we start looking at some of the physiological ones, we see things like obviously decreases in performance. We see cortisol initially rise, but when you hit overtraining, in many cases, cortisol falls to a new low because your body simply won't respond anymore. All these stress-related hormones will initially rise to deal with the stress of training and then bottom out when the body finally exhausts. So the nice thing about science is we're really getting to a point where we can predict it rather than just detect it. And if we can do that, athletes are gonna stay a step ahead when it comes to their training.